Hello everyone, like in old good days I decided to create a Google Colab notebook which allows you to generate images for free on any device without GPU. This user interface is also optimized specifically for phones, so you can use it even on your mobile phone. The process is very simple and straightforward. Uh, no coding skills required, just please follow the instruction. All you need to do, just follow the link below under this video on my Patreon page. It's free, but you can still support me, I really appreciate it. But another way to support this channel, this video, just press like button and watch this video until the end, because it's the best way to support and promote this video for other users. Thank you. Follow this link and uh, open Google Collab Notebook here. Okay, all you need to do just uh, press runtime tab, change runtime type, that should be Tesla T4 GPU. And then just press only this button here, that's it. You most likely will get a warning that um, this notebook is not authorized, uh, is not created by Google and it is not safe. It's okay because you don't send any personal information to this notebook. And you can trust me. <laughs> uh, the installation process takes about three minutes, very, very fast. Uh, Google Collab gives you a free GPU, about four hours GPU usage per day. Uh, quite generous of them. It's also possible to use different account, just an idea. For generating images, we are using Stable Diffusion Excel model, uh, but you can download any model you like. And I also created a different version of this notebook specifically for my Patreon supporters. Uh, there are some features which makes using this notebook more uh, convenient, and we will cover it a little bit later. All right, after two and a half minutes we've got our link follow this link okay we are in a gradio interface and it works pretty simple just enter a prompt here let it be a cat in a cowboy hat and here also in a settings tab where you can specify the negative prompt seat um, the dimension the size of the image guidance scales and tabs well uh, for using a random seat you should choose uh, minus one or any city you like, just specify it here. That's it. Okay, just test it, press run button. Uh, the generation process takes about 15 seconds for one image in a standard resolution. All right, we just generated image and it works pretty well. Uh, this uh, base version of Stable Diffusion Excel without uh, any restriction. All right, and also very, very important, don't forget to close your session. Because as I said before, you had about four hours per day of using GPU for free. And it would be really nice of you to turn off uh, the runtime if you don't use it. To do this, you need just a uh, press runtime button here, runtime tab here, and disconnect and delete runtime. All your data, all information will be deleted, so don't forget to uh, download all your images and press yes. As I said before, there are also a different version of this call-up notebook specifically for my Patreon subscribers. And this version works pretty similar. Just open this uh, call-up notebook and press this button here and that's it. And here you can also add any model you like, not only Stable Diffusion Excel base version, but any way you like, any way you find in a uh, CVTI or Hugging Face. Uh, to do this, just uh, find download link and pass it here to this widget uh, line of code. Also, um, you can basically use the same method for downloading custom models in a base version of Notebook. All right, after two and a half minutes, we've got our link, follow this link. What is the difference? There are some minor difference uh, here. I added the ability to change a sampler method. You can choose whatever you like. Also, you can generate several images at the same time. Let it be four images. And also really, really nice feature, it's translate prompt. 
just press on this check mark here to translate prompt and uh, you can prompt you can enter your prompt in any language you like there's no need in specifying the language it will be identified automatically and translated to english for using in stable diffusion excel all right so let's test it out well i take a prompt in spanish and let's test it out we generate four images uh, with uh, let it be Euler method, Euler sampler, and press on button here. Uh, well, there are also uh, translated prompt option, which allows you to control uh, how this uh, notebook translate your prompt to English. This is very important for generation control. And also there are the same settings like in a base version. Also a very important feature is the ability to download all images at once, only by pressing one button. I'll show you how to use it a little bit later. All right, we just generated our images. Uh, it's a cat sitting on a tree. Yes, that was exactly what I entered here in Spanish. Okay. That looks actually really, really nice. You can download image by pressing this button here. And uh, here, this button for view in a full screen. As I said before, if you have a lot of images, for example, you can generate up to 32, I suppose, images. Well, if you generated a lot of images, uh, the easiest way to uh, download all these images, just press this button here. And now we just created uh, a deep file which you can download just by pressing this button here. And that's it. Very simple and very convenient. I would like to say a big thank you to guys who support me on our Patreon. I'll create much more notebook like this uh, with this user interface. I probably will add image to image feature, most likely in paint. And I really hope that Google Colab will not block this uh, user interface for you. And I also I will add more models. Uh, let me know what you think about it. And uh, thank you for watching this video. Uh, if you like this video, press like button and bye bye.